Muhammad Zahir Shah was proclaimed king on November 8, 1933, after his father was assassinated. After the Second World War, he recognized the need for modernizing Afghanistan. Unfortunately for him, however, a democratic constitution was ratified in 1964, which ousted him from the throne. In 1965, People's Democratic Party of Afghanistan held its first Congress. On April 20th, 1978, the Sao Revolution began. Military units allied with the Democratic Party and assaulted and killed the president. They then established a new president. <clears throat> Not long after, a rebellion against the new Afghan government began with an uprising in the Nuristan province after the change. Thank you very much. Hello? Okay, so it's 1978 now, and I haven't talked to you since 1976. So, they revolted again, and uh, I kind of need some help here. It's my good buddy, Afghanistan. How are you doing? Oh, help, you say? This proves I can supply. <laughs> That is ever so great for you, of you to help my presidency because I am the president of Afghanistan. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the Afghanistan. I will see you soon. The Soviets take over the major buildings in Kabul. Afghanistan tries to bring it back. Not here, you villainous scum. This is just you and me now! The power of rock can't save you! No! No! The power of rock! It is too strong! No! Oh, no! Get out of here, you Soviet! But Russia is so cold! Get out. Rest. All the Soviets have left Afghanistan. We have now created the Islamic State of Afghanistan. In August 1994, the Taliban government began to form a small village between the Lashkar Ga and the Kandahar. Taliban, with Pakistan's support, initiated a military campaign against the Islamic State of Afghanistan in its capital of Kabul. September 20th, 2001, after the September 11 attack in the United States, U.S. President George W. Bush demanded the Taliban government to hand over al-Qaeda head Osama bin Laden and close all terrorist training camps in the country. Yeah, um, we were, we were really considering the possible October 7, Operation Enduring Freedom, the United States and the United Kingdom began aerial bombing and campaigning, campaigning against Al-Qaeda and the Taliban. <laughs> Oh, 
رسول الله وسلم عليك يا حبيب الله فرمائش مجھے کی گئی ہے ایک حمد کے لئے اسی کے جنہ شاعر پیش کرتا ہوں विगड़े सारे कम बना अल्लाए विगड़े सारे 